So we're here at Nightingale Centre doing Great Hecklow for a senior weekend for 14 to 17 year olds. And as we were talking to the people, we realised that some of our youth do do volunteering work. And seeing as this year's GA has a theme of volunteers, we thought, why not make a film about it? So now we're going to hear from some of our youth telling about the volunteering work that they do and how they help other people. So Carrie, I heard you do some volunteering work. I do. And what volunteering work is that, Carrie? Um, I work with something called STAR right. in my school, where we, um, the younger kids come to um, talk to us about their problems, and we try and sort of resolve it with them, or we're just there to listen. So how often do you do that, Carrie? Um, I do it about every week. Do you find it self-rewarding, or do you get a bit I tired? I do, I do. Um, it's, it's nice to sort of be able to help people and make a difference. Do you sometimes find though, that you can't help the other person? It is really frustrating when you can't help them. You know, sometimes there's nothing you can do and you have to get the teachers involved, but other than that, yeah. So do you think after maybe you've finished in school, you're in sitcom, now you'll carry on with volunteering? I will, definitely, definitely. Would you recommend volunteering to any of our youth and adults? I would, you know, it's, it's really self-rewarding and it just makes you feel good. <laughs> So Ross, I heard that you also do some volunteering work. Yeah, um, I volunteer to help with the autistic children at um, the youth club in our town um, just to build their self-confidence and social skills. How often do you do that volunteering? Um, maybe once a month or twice a month. Do you find it very self-rewarding or sometimes just like, oh, this isn't worth it? Um, I found it self-rewarding because it's good to help other people who are less fortunate than you are. Do you think the people that you're helping find, you know, that you are actually helping them? Or do you sometimes feel like they're not getting it at all? Um, I think they know that we're helping them because they have told us themselves that um, their skills have improved with making friends and socialising. Would you say to any of our youth or any of our adults in our movement that they should try volunteering? Um, yeah, I would. It's a very rewarding experience, even though there is no real money involved, and that's a good thing about it. Sarah, I heard you do some volunteering work. Yeah, um, I'm a young leader with my local Brownie Pack, which is young children from the ages of 7 to 11. Do you enjoy volunteering? Yeah, I do enjoy it. It's really rewarding and I like helping other people. How often do you do your volunteering? Every week. Do you think that it's helping the younger Brownies to have more like social skills and have more fun? Or? Um, I hope so. I like to think that I can sort of influence them a bit. Um, and I enjoy it and they enjoy it too. So. Good. Being a young leader, do you think that some of our youth in our movement should start helping out with rainbows and brownies and things like that as well? Um, yeah, I mean, everyone is going to have people that have given up time for them. So, like, I mean, I do it an hour a week. To me, it's nothing, but to them it means a lot. So, and it's really rewarding, so I think everyone should give it a go. Tilly, you do volunteering work, I've heard. Um, yeah, I've just started though at my church um, because I'm a bit older than the rest of the kids. They've decided to make me a leader in my Sunday school, which is kind of cool. Do you enjoy doing the volunteering or were you kind of like, oh no, I don't want to do this? I was a bit freaked out at first because you don't really know when it's with kids, but actually I know them really well and it's really just to be an extra person just to sort of look out for them and make sure that they're doing what they need to do. Do you think they appreciate you being there or do you think they're kind of like, oh no, another leader? No, I, th I think they appreciate me being there, mainly because I'm, well, I'm not the same age, but I'm of a similar age to them, a lot younger than the other two leaders, so I think that makes them a bit more relaxed around me. Do you think people in the movement, youth and adults, should start volunteering then? I do. I think it helps a lot for people to put themselves out and do things without getting any tangible reward because it just, it does make you feel really good and it sort of shows your appreciation for what other people are doing a lot more than if you were doing something just to get something back, like 
money or something. So you wouldn't really like to do it for money, you're quite happy that you're just doing it as kind of like charity work sort of thing? <laughs> I wouldn't mind getting money, <laughs> but I'm happy to volunteer.